Now smart watches have been a hot topic lately and today I have here the Xiaomi Mi Watch or fitness tracker. Now the Mi Watch was released 8 months ago alongside the Mi 10 T series at a price of 99 euros and I've been using it for the past 5 months. The watch comes with a 1.4 inch AMOLED display which is a decent size screen. It has an aluminium frame weighing in at just about 32 grams which is pretty light. The watch is also 5 ATM water resistant which is a necessity for watches these days especially if it's a fitness tracker. There's a home button on the top right of the watch for accessing all the apps and there's a sports button on the bottom right for accessing all the sports modes. Talking about the sports modes, it has over 117 of them. Now to be really honest, I've only used like a handful of them, like swimming or running etc. But it's nice to see Xiaomi adding sports tracking features that you wouldn't normally find on other watches. I've used it while swimming, running and cycling and it's pretty accurate at tracking all my activities. It also has an inbuilt GPS which means you can leave your phone at home and it will still track all your activities and sync them up with your phone when you're back. The Mi Watch also comes with an accelerometer, a heart rate sensor, barometer, a compass and a blood oxygen sensor. The 24 hour heart rate monitoring is pretty decent and it can also measure your elevation and air pressure which is useful for hiking or trekking. The blood oxygen sensor however is only a flex on the spec sheet, just don't use it for any medical purposes. The Mi Watch also has sleep tracking but personally I'm not a big fan of sleep tracking and I haven't used it much. It also has stress level monitoring which is nice to see. The display on the Mi Watch is pretty bright. It goes up to 450 nits which is decent for outside use. It does get a little hard to see at noon but it's nothing deal breaking. It also has an auto brightness feature but I just keep it at max brightness. There are also over 100 watch faces to choose from from the Xiaomi Wear app. Now the display is AMOLED which does indeed give you the option for the always on display. There was one issue however that the always on display wasn't compatible with the raised to wake but Xiaomi did put an update after like a month which did make the, both the features compatible. There are a couple watch face options for the always on display but I would have liked more options and maybe even a customizable one. Let's talk about battery life. The watch charges magnetically via the dock provided in the box. Xiaomi advertises up to 16 days of battery life but with the way I've been using it with max brightness and always on display I usually have to charge it after every 5 or 6 days. The charging speed is decent, it's not too fast but the watch gets fully charged from 0 to 100% in 1 and a half hours. Unfortunately you can't download any songs or apps on the watch since it is technically still a fitness tracker. For the price it does have some competition from the Amazfit series and even the OnePlus watch but depending on the region and availability the OnePlus watch may be higher in price.